We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us. The roots of anonymous lie particularly in so-called image boards on which all uncut and unpresented pictures and messages can leave and also a name can be given. Indeed. Somebody hardly acts. Why most contributions with the name anonymous are marked. Hence. Thus the name of the group probably comes that according to technical presetting with undeclared use all entries are marked in the image boards with anonymous. With the time this kind of the publication attained the status of an internet phenomenon, the participant users are called shortened anon. Typically for anonymous it are of the graphic novel be like Vendetta of Alan Moore and David Lloyd to take in masks which should show originally the face of the British freedom fighter Guy Fox. These serve as a registration number as well as to the anonymous Yerung and in the course of the protest actions also for the protection from pursuit by Scientology within the scope of her so-called fairly game policy. David Lloyd who welcomes illustrator of the comic, that the people use his mask for this protest. She has become a symbol of the protest against the tyranny. On the internet videos on YouTube are put for the spreading by information to the public often, Anonymous existed in the initial stage mainly of users of various image boards and internet forums. In addition, different wikis and internet chats were put up to the organization to use even more space on the internet. About these platforms protests are organized like Project Chanology. Altogether Anonymous is a loose connection of the internet users who are to be found in the virtual space above all on web pages like 711chan, 420chan, 4CHAN, Something Awful, FARC or Encyclopedia Dramatica. Social networks like Facebook play rather a minor part, however, are used to the education of so-called cells which can be mobilized then to real protest. Anonymous has no leaders or controlling authorities and is based on the collective strength of his individual participants and the advantage that information on the internet can be fast spread. Though some websites determine that only adults should look at the contents from 18 years, because there is, however, no sure possibility to block younger visitors, some anons are also underage. Everybody which wants can be anonymous and towards the aims work we have this program with which we agree everybody and which we see coordinate everybody and explain, but everybody works independently towards it without needing a confirmation. We want to do only something from which we think that it must be done anonymous, cited by Chris Landers in Baltimore City Paper, 2nd of April, 2008. It exists neither a guidance nor a membership in the administrative sense, and helping is thereby absolutely non-binding. There is no central organizational structure or hierarchy which would be binding for all members of the group in any form. It concerns with anonymous not an organization in the customary sense, but rather a movement. Every activist can decide freely just as one likes what he would like to do. This could be also used by criminals. In the beginning limited itself anonymous in his demands primarily on the ban of the Church of Scientology and their methods and institutions. Besides, the faith of the Scientologian or other organizations should not be attacked. Outgoing censorship is lately directed at Anonymous more and more against internet censorship as well as from the state. One can recognize this above all by the events in Australia in which members of Anonymous have attacked internet sites of the Australian government, after this one law of the implementing of internet filters had agreed. Anonymous also fell by DOS attacks against finance enterprise like PayPal as well as the credit card enterprises Visas and MasterCard which keeps the access to his accounts before the whistleblower portal WikiLeaks, or these had closed, on. These attacks were expanded afterwards on Tunisia and Zimbabwe, because these countries threatened to sue everybody, the WikiLeaks documents publishes. In the mass protests against the Law Plans Acta and SOPA Anonymous was decisively co-involved. The opposition arisen in 2013 against bilateral and multilateral free trade agreements like TTIP or CETA is also supported by Anonymous. Basically Anonymous always declares in various video messages to cite all violators of human rights, censors and dictators as aims. However, there rules moreover no consensus, because it seems impossible absolutely to put to the vote all people accompanying feeling the group is so are to involve them. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.